Hey guys, welcome back to the channel once again. I am Robert Storm. If you're finding me for the very first time, please be sure to click that like and subscribe button. Also, guys, in the description box below and pinned comments is a link to our Discord channel. Click the link. Become a part of Storm Nation. We are currently giving away a Nintendo Switch Lite on June 21st. Details on how to win the Switch Lite is on the Discord to become a member. So, wasn't really... You know, expecting to do a second video today, but here we are. Um, you know, I did the, the Batwoman one earlier, but this is more of a serious thing. This is something that um, I've been talking about mostly all week, and I want to continue to do updates on it. Um, I just found out, I don't know how recent this is, but the other three officers that were involved in George Floyd's death have now been charged. I have the uh, charges uh, with me, or not with me, but I have the charges in front of me. Um, I, I just got done watching the news. I just got home, and I wanted to do a video on this. So um, the main officer who had his knee on his neck, on George Floyd's neck, um, his charge has been upgraded to second-degree murder. And then the other three officers, the two that were on his legs, and then the Asian officer who would just pretty much just stand there doing nothing, is charged with aiding and abetting and second-degree murder. Now, look, guys, I'm not going to mess with you. I'm not going to sit here and tell you guys I know what all these things things mean i have no clue okay I, I i am smart enough to know that i'm not smart enough to know this stuff okay um all i know is the other three officers should have been charged absolutely should have been charged i said that in my very first video about george floyd what happened to george floyd is horrendous it happens too much in this country and uh, again i've been saying this all week enough is enough Enough is enough. We need some change going on. And I am thrilled that the other three officers have been charged as well. Again, I don't know what the charges mean. You know, second degree murder. What's the difference between second degree, first degree, and third degree? I have no idea. I'm not a lawyer. I don't know what any of that means. Um, so I don't know what the difference between a third degree and second degree murder charges are. Um, apparently, the family of George Floyd were really wanting to get a first degree charge from the guy who was on uh, George Floyd's neck. Um, but the... I guess um, prosecutors felt like it would be hard to convict him for that, and they want him to serve time. So they went with a second-degree charge because it would be more easier to convince a jury that, yes, it was second-degree. Again, way out of the realm of my expertise, my knowledge. If you ask me, son, about Spider-Man, I know that. Um, but but when it comes to charges, I just I, I don't know. So, um, I am happy that all four officers are now charged with the death and murder of George Floyd. Again, too much stuff has been going on in this country for way too long. Far too long, guys. Enough is enough. Um, I seen John Boyega had a very passionate uh, speech at a rally, which I'm so happy that someone like John, John Boyega was able to... Because let's be honest, John Boyega really became a, a massive star thanks to Star Wars, okay? Like, he did, like, attack the block and stuff like that, but a lot of people don't know who John Boyega was until Star Wars. And I'm glad he's using that... that Fame that that trampoline that that catapult uh, trampoline catapult sure I, I'm glad that John Boyega was able to use that platform that catapulted him into a more uh, household name and is now using that for positive things. That's what you should do, right? If you know you you you're able to make a point, make a statement, you need to come out and you need to fight for the right thing. Same thing I see Norman Reedus at, at a rally. You know, yes, yeah, these people that have a huge following. Now is the time. I don't care if you're white, black, Hispanic, Chinese, Vietnamese, Namekian. I don't care. If you have a platform, you need to come out because that's the only way things are going to change. I hear I hear people people say this uh, for the past couple of days. People are like, well, there, there's more to the story than meets the eye. You know, George Floyd tried to pay something with counterfeit money. Who gives a fuck? So he tried to pay something with counterfeit money. Does he deserve to lose his life for that? You know, the, 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 I don't care what he did. I don't care what he did because nothing he did other like nothing he did other than him possibly taking the life of someone else should result him losing his life. He was an unarmed man handcuffed and on his stomach. And he had two officers holding his legs down while another officer proceeded to stick his knee in his neck for 10 minutes. I don't give a fuck if it was counterfeit money. I don't care if it was fucking Monopoly money. Okay? No one deserves to lose their life for something like that. I don't care. You are here to serve and protect. Serve and protect. Not sit there and harass and kill. And it, I, I, again, I don't care about this. I don't. It's about human life. It's about life. 
in general. One of the things that I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna kind of express. I live by a code myself, okay. Um, and, and this is gonna sound really nerdy, but it's something I believe in. Um, in one of the seasons of Game of Thrones, Jon Snow confronted Mance Raider. And he went up to Mance Raider, and, and these are two opposite enemies, right? Like, like two, two complete opposites. Mance Raider with the Wildlings, and Jon Snow's job is to protect the wall from the Wildlings. And Jon Snow went up to Mance Raider, and he goes, I am on the side that fights for the living. That is the code I live by. I don't care if you're white, black, or where you're from. I don't care. I am on the side that fights for the living. What happened to George Floyd and what happened to more countless people over the human history of the history of America it has gone on way too long. I fight for the side that fights for black rights, white rights, Hispanic rights, Vietnamese rights, Chinese rights, cat rights, dog rights, Shamu, I don't care. Like, if you are a living thing, you have the right to live. I don't care if you pay with counterfeit money. And to see that these twinkle toe cocksucker officers are all being charged, good. Good. And maybe, maybe the next officer, the next racist officer, or the next officer that think he has too much power and he's above the law, next time they want to try to pull some shit like this, let them think back to the officers that got charged for killing George Floyd. And let them think twice and go, yeah, maybe I shouldn't do that. That's why this is so important. It isn't just about a race thing, although it is 100% a race thing. But it's also bigger than that. George Floyd's death, may he rest in peace, is catapulting this nation into something that I have not seen in my lifetime. People are binding together to try to do something. Again, it's about human life. And hopefully, George Floyd's death won't be in vain. And hopefully, the next racist officer or next officer who feels like they are above the law will remember and go, yeah. So, I don't know. I, I kind of went on a really long tangent there. Um, I, I'm sorry. I'm just a little fired up, man. I, I hate seeing this stuff happen. I hate seeing this stuff happen. Um, I, I, I really, my, my sympathies go out to George Floyd's family. Um, I hope, I hope, I hope he's looking down. I hope he's, he's resting in peace. And I hope that um, his death will not go in vain. But I just kind of wanted to come out here and, uh, just kind of give you guys an update on what's going on with the officers. Um, the the trial is going to be interesting. The trial is going to be very, very interesting and see what happens. But, yeah, um, it had to come. It had to come, man. And, uh, again, I, I'm not smart enough to tell you guys what, what all these different charges mean and what's the difference between this and what's the difference that. The, 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 the truth is they, they've been charged now. So now we just got to take the next step and then the next step, and then we'll see what happens. But, anyway, guys. I went on for far too long. Just kind of want to throw an update out there. I will be streaming Witcher 3 later on tonight. So I hope you guys come check that out. Um, that's how you'll be able to enter to win the uh, Switch Lite. Also, join the Discord. There's more details on how to win. Uh, the link is in the description and pinned comment. Love each and every one of you guys. Please stay safe out there. Until next time, I'm Robert Storms, and that's my opinion, guys. Later.